When the first case of hepatitis A was announced at a Jonesboro restaurant last year, all employees at Terry's Cafe in Paragould decided to get their hepatitis A vaccinations. We don't want anybody to get sick when they eat here. We want to present a clean atmosphere to them, you know, where they can come and enjoy and know their food safe. This takes one case that can run your business. State Representative Jack Ladyman is now working with the Arkansas Department of Health to propose a bill to make hepatitis A vaccinations a requirement for food industry workers in counties where two or more cases are reported. That would or should prevent hepatitis A be transferring to customers. So I think it would help the restaurants as well as the individuals eating out. If, if people felt comfortable that, hey, these restaurant workers are protected. Representative Lady Men's bill doesn't just apply to restaurants, but to any business where employees handle food, which means that workers in delis at supermarkets and at school cafeterias will be required to receive hepatitis A vaccinations as well. The ADH confirmed over 300 cases of hepatitis A across the region and plans to provide vaccinations free of charge. In some cases, it can be very serious and people can die from it. It's fortunate that hepatitis A disease it can be prevented with the vaccine after someone has been exposed. If they get that vaccine within two weeks of exposure. Once passed, Representative Ladyman's bill could go into effect by July. For Northeast Arkansas News, I'm Simone Jameson.